All right, welcome everyone. We're back again with another. Uh, we still technically have names because these are bonding with whiteheads. Let's keep bond, it. Bond, uh, we still haven't said bond. Because not hearing it, I, I don't know. No Regardless, we could just we could always say we got our bond money. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. Like we got our bond money, but we're doing another James Bond. We're doing the second one. We're doing uh, from Russia with Love. Whitehead just watched it last night. Uh, of course, before we get into it. With me as always, Mr. Whitehead. Joining us as always. Hello, hello. Our, our legal counsel and Mr. Ian's with us. What's up, baby? Um, yeah, uh, Whitehead, how did you feel about this second one? Uh, I liked it a lot. I think it was way better than Dr. No. Kind of set on it for a day now and kind of yeah. had a little time to process. Yeah. So I was thinking back to the, like, the fight scene in the... Uh, or the I don't train. know, just the... the, the the Russian or the Spectre agent. I just thought, he yeah, was he's fucking the, dude. Dope. I, I just remember that fight scene there. That uh, in the middle, kind of like it was kind of long. It was a long oh, fight tra- scene on the train. Um, not not on the train. It was like when they were. Uh, it looked like uh, military was fight was involved and shit, and they were like. Um, I remember because there was like, oh oh, at the gypsy camp. Yeah 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 yeah. Sorry, I thought I was thinking hand to hand fight. Yeah, but that that was that was a long fight scene. Yeah, I this is. Probably like like I said I said to you last night every watch this is like my favorite Connery one personally I don't think it's necessarily well I, I kind of do think it's the best one but it's my personal favorite but I think when it's better than Octopussy yeah it's more though <laughs> but like I said when when people think of sixties Bond I think in their mind they picture Goldfinger yeah because yeah. that was like th- that'll be the next one we watch yeah but um yeah go over it some more what were the aspects because I do like this one better than Doctor No if I'm just being honest. Doctor No was cool. Yeah, Doctor. Yeah, Doctor No was cool. The uh, the sidekick was cool, cooler in this one. Oh, uh, the Turkish. Mm-hmm. Well, I can't think of his name. I can't. Papa. His na- I just, the we Papa. Just called Papa the whole time. He had a million yeah, sons. That, uh, yeah, yeah. That, yeah. That guy. That guy was a dog too. Yeah. I like how he kept saying he's like, "Oh yeah, limo driver." My son. He just kept bringing up, "Oh yeah, that's also my son." Oh like, my god. I fuck a lot, man. Oh yeah, he. he I yeah. fuck more than you. Cause, cause <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's dude. I, I was thinking that. I was thinking yeah. that at one point. I was like, dude, that dude gets more pussy than James Bond does, man. James Bond is like, whoa, bro. Like, how did you snag? Or, her? guys, guys, or he has a very dedicated, healthy marriage. Ma- yeah, I mean, I like exa- it, it, it could just be he, he loves, <laughs> that his, is my he loves his wife oh, oh, oh. very much. She is a, a, a giver sexually and is. And <laughs> you, you made some assumptions about him that, that these come from multiple mothers. It could just be. I like. To, I like to think it's multiple. Like he's had a lot of wives. And That's what I like to think. And as mistresses well. and whatever the fuck he wants. But again, I mean, you, 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 Yeah, he's got a harem. No, right. Karim. That was his name, dude. Oh, you, you, you're, you're, you're you're one dimensionalizing him. He could be a two dimensional character that has a very loving wife. And that girl though. Sons. That that girl though. And I'm just saying this is ironic. I'm just saying maybe it's a coincidence. I don't think one woman could do sixty four kids. Well, uh, this one girl. This Asian one girl. Egypt. The first girl we have you saw. Read the Bible, Matthew. Yeah, I have. Okay, good then. Uh, what was your favorite scripture? <laughs> <laughs> That's not related uh, to I, I know, uh, I, wrestling. And we, and we, fuck, and <laughs> fuck, 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 fuck. Damn, Okay, right, yeah, yeah. And I can't. I was, I was about to say no. Stone Cold Steve Austin three sixteen. I was gonna say no Psalms. I don't know. I've heard that. What were you about uh, to say about the woman, though, Ian? The first woman we saw, she comes out of the uh, James Bond's like, oh, right in here, and they're like, yeah, yeah just going here. And uh, this beautiful woman comes out, and she's like straightening her dress, like, all right, you know, get the girl straight and sit. Uh, James Bond's like, damn, night, night, good N- sit. And he goes in, and the guy's like, oh, what's up, James? He's Are like, you talking about when that rocket hit a? Like she's like, come on, have him to live, whatever. That was like laying all on the thing, and the rocket hit. I think it was like it might have been like right after that or something because like uh, he she she's straightening her dress as she's leaving and then yeah. he goes oh, okay. in and talks yeah, to he her and he's like and he's like over there straightening the the silk the golden silk sheets out oh what's up James I'm yeah we were just having sex <laughs> like kinda, I don't know now I, I did bring that up earlier uh, I do feel like this one like yeah he got girls in the first one this one feels so much more over sexual than Doctor No by comparison. Yeah, like yeah, there was girls all over the place. Like at one point, Bond, like, all of, f- of them were ugly compared to her. Oh yeah, like, like whatever, he, her, whatever her name was, it, she, she was, was his. It, uh, dude, the, there was there was one one of the uh, one of the gypsy girls or whatever. I don't know. If I'm allowed to. I don't know if I'm allowed to say that anymore. But uh, 
But fucking one of those girls, the dark headed girl. Tatiana, you liked her, the main Bond girl. Yeah, yeah. She was very pretty. She was very hot, yeah. She She made Halle Berry look like a fucking dog. Mm, I'm going to go that far. Wolf, wolf. They might be the same. <laughs> I, I guess it, I don't know. I thought she was. I thought she was. Uh, she was sixties fine. All right, for I, I'm, sure. I, I'm actually right there with you. I thought so too. She's actually one of my compared f- to Halle Berry. Yes. Well, yeah. I mean, I Sorry, guess Halle Berry in the in the Bond movie. This like, chick, I don't know. Her name is uh, definitely Daniela Bianchi. She played Tatiana Romanoff, which is the main Bond girl in this. She is, I think, one of the better Bond girls. She's t- uh, she's super hot. And again, she, she wasn't very. Uh, well, I mean. She wasn't like running around in a bikini or anything, you know what I'm saying? She was just yeah. dressed she didn't ha- up. She didn't have to. Yeah, like they, she was. They had cla- her, she's very classy. Attractive. They had her in that. They had her in that nighty and shit on the train or whatever. That little and dress. She kept and stuff. doing her little dressing oh, up for him. She, yeah, that was that was nice. I wish I was James. She was. Ah man, one one thing I've noticed the last these last two James Bond movies, like yeah, James gets the chicks and stuff like that, but he like he doesn't really give them a choice. <laughs> <laughs> like he could ease. I'm just saying the the. James Bond character from the and I love him, but the James Bond character, the way he's picking these chicks up and stuff, if it would happen in the two thousand whatever teens and stuff, he'd he's be in getting trouble. he's getting me tooed. Oh, like, yeah, probably. Uh, but I, I will say this: they are throwing them at him in this one. But I don't get my mom. I don't want to get on a tangent too much about the Bond girls, but this is one of the rare exceptions at the beginning. The girl he's with, eating lunch with, that he does have sex for. He goes, "I'll do his assignment." That's the chick <laughs> from Doctor No at the beginning at the casino that met him. One oh. of the rare instances. Could they actually imagine? have a repeat? I did not yeah. realize that. Because she, she, cause she said she was like, uh, Where you going? he was like, I gotta go and shit, and she was like, and he was like, What about, yeah, she, about lunch? Yeah, she was like, the last time you left, you had to go to the last movie and see, that's, you know, oh, yeah, so she's I had like, to wait. He went to, she's like, she references that he goes to Kingston, Jamaica. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Doctor yeah. No, but uh, one thing I do want to throw out before we we'll get off the girls, I think this is the only time this happens ever in the Bonds, but. Technically, he has a three-way in this one at one point. Yeah, they don't I, I show it. I assume so. I assume Those so. Those two gypsy oh, yeah, girls get yeah. thrown at him. He's like, I'll take care of them. I'll, I'll settle their bicker. I'll pick. <laughs> uh, but uh, I assume so. Another assume reason why I, I really loved, what would you, Karim? Karim, yeah. <laughs> he was like, yeah, let's take you somewhere safe. <laughs> to, gy- to the gypsy <laughs> land. Yeah, let's take you to the gypsy camp where... I think he goes a lot. Yeah, no, it's he hangs out. Like, yeah, he knew what was going on. Didn't he know some motherfuckers there and shit? Oh, he was, somebody gave him a bottle. He was just sitting there like, ah, drinking. Hey, yeah. He was He was having fun. <laughs> James, like, because he was like, these two women are going to fight because they're in love with the same man. Whatever happens, Bond, don't get involved. Yeah. And he was like, yeah, I'm not getting involved. And they had a belly dancer and stuff. Ah. And also, too, it's important to note, after that battle you were talking about, Ian, mm-hmm. the head gypsy guy just, James Bond saves his life in the middle of the battle. Yeah, I was going to mention Karim's translating for him, and he looks over at Bond and was like, "He says you're his son now, Bond. Yeah, you saved his life." I was gonna just mention that shit earlier. I thought that I, shit was yeah, funny. I kind of forgot about that. that and they're yeah. probably close absurd. to the same age. Which was he, funny. Said, he said, uh, he said, uh, he said, uh, he said, he said, he's th- he's thankful for you that you saved his life and stuff. So he says you're his son now. But then he laughed and shit, and he said, "But you're too small. You could never be a gypsy." And shit yeah, like he's like, that. You're too, "You ain't fat like me." And I was thinking, like, I bet they would not mind having James Bond as a gypsy. Come on, Hell man, he's no. pretty uh, slick. But let's get back on some other fire points of the movie, not to get off on the girls too much. What'd you think about the gadgets, Whitehead? Like the briefcase and stuff. They're pretty neat. Not not too out there, but I like that he did use most of them. Yeah, I, I know he we never we, used the gun. Yeah, though. like in the briefcase. Remember the briefcase had a gun in it. Oh, because he showed him how the ammo loaded at the beginning in the oh, office. Yeah. Key oh, did. I thought that was a secret ammo. Yeah, I thought he oh, had, I th- had more. Bullets. I thought he meant like the, the briefcase like, could shoot two. Legal well, counsel. What 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 did you think it was? I thought it was just additional ammo. That's yeah, what I thought too. Because he had that really cool breakdown rifle. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, I thought he meant like the briefcase well, to he, shoot to. No, no the, the way that. the way it lo- looks like it loads in it looks. I don't know. It just sounds. Yeah, because he like silly. poured the bullets out in now, his hand. Later, later bombs. I could see maybe them doing that. Yeah. Yeah. But this one, I don't know. I, that's kind of why I like this one because it didn't like. I don't know. Felt right. more grounded. Yeah. Yeah, it did. It it did all the way. Yeah, I I could definitely see that. It did feel uh, more grounded all the way through. Um, I was actually a fan of the uh, the last one myself. It's just like, I like I like his introduction and shit, and like I uh, wasn't a fan of the ending and stuff. But but uh, but now nah, this one was. I thought this was really cool too. I enjoyed the gadgets as well. Yeah, and the I like how Spectre. I guess was more of a prominent figure in, in this, this one. one. Yeah, I liked. Uh, Pretty much their overall plot because they're just trying to get that translator machine. It's a simple enough plot, 
And then uh, they actually make that sex tape. They're like, we were going to use that too to like throw shade at you after we killed you. Um, well, he, didn't, he really didn't seem up too upset. Yeah, he did not. I liked uh, on the train with the, the Robert Shaw, the Russian Spectre agent. I liked that little like mind game they had with each other, like where they go to dinner and shit. Because he knew the whole time, like, this dude I don't think's my guy. Especially when he, I thought it was slick how he switched the briefcases. Yeah, and the whole one thing I was kind of like, come on, man! Like, all right, whenever the Spectre agent walks up to to the man, and he just, I think he just walks up holding a cigarette. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken. And then the agent's just like, oh, oh okay, let's, let's yeah. go over here. And then Bond, whenever Bond meets him, he just like. I can't remember. They, they say their little code back and forth about lighters or whatever. I didn't. Oh, think, yeah. No, no, I didn't think they did. I thought they just kind of like showed each other they were smoking. They were like, "Oh, okay, you know, let's just." Yeah, I'm trying to remember this, the slightest detail because I, I don't. I don't think they say it. They didn't, and that guy he started didn't. talking with the British accent immediately. Yeah, because he took the guy Bond was supposed to meet and yeah, but, him. but they didn't say the code word either. They just kind of like fucking looked at each other with tobacco and lighters in hand, and it's just like if you had a secret code. You should use it. Use it. That's a that's that agent's fault. He deserved a fucking whatever fate he got, which is death probably. <laughs> it, yeah, he did die. I mean, pretty, he, pretty clearly death. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't remember if they showed the body. Well, he he strangled him with his own little garrote or whatever. Oh, 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 you're talking about the British one? Yeah. Yeah. No, that guy was just a weak sauce, I think, and did get killed. Yeah. 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 They yeah, did not show by. You are correct on that. I kind of was thinking uh, the Russian agent would come back, like. You liked him too. I thought he's actually one of the better villains. He, I he think. was pretty dope because, like, yeah. he went, like during like the gypsy fight, whenever he's just up there, I thought he was going to join the fight, but now he's just up there just watching. making sure Bond doesn't die. And, and, like kills a dude, and Bond like realizes somebody like he was just like, who the fuck took that shot? Yeah, and he's just like, okay, I'm gonna gonna he's keep like, doing whatever you know I'm doing with this fight. Yeah. Uh, how'd you feel about uh, action in this one? I like it. Good. Yeah, like, I, I don't know what it is. I like the stuff with the helicopter, the little gypsy shootout. There's a lot more cat and mouse in this one, kind of, and it feels mm. sort of like old schooler spy stuff, even by, like, 1962 standards. Like, what's uh, the book we both like, Hudson? Uh, Joseph Conrad, The Secret Agent? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I would say it kind of reminds me of stuff like that. Um, yeah, this is one of my personal favorite ones, and I thought the boat was kind of cool. Yeah, because um, i trying to think. Because, like, compa- the, comparing this one to, like... Dr. No. Well, I was thinking, of, like, even the Daniel Craig ones, because I have seen some of those. Mm-hmm. Like, I don't know, this one didn't have as much action as those. Yeah. But it still worked. Yeah, oh, like, yeah. they had a pretty good set pieces, like that shit with the helicopter, because Sean Connery almost died making this one, because the helicopter almost hit him, because they were... Like, they did that shit for real, which I thought was cool, because yeah. that was the only way they could do it back then. And I was... I. I was really upset whenever Karam died. Yeah, I feel bad for you, man, because these, these little side <laughs> does he have get killed. Does, does he have one in every movie? No, not necessarily. Oh, but okay. but uh, th- th- that is one thing I kind of think they were like, hey, we should have a, like when they were making this one, like we should have a side guy again, like in Doctor No, and he'll get killed. But uh, at least in this one, Bond was very sad when he died, and he gave him the little shoulder, his body, the little like. Damn it, man. Yeah, but I don't know. They're, them fucking around. Like, he, he was b- boasting having all these sons, and, you know, like, that's, I guess, how they kept everything in, in line. line. But not once did he ask his sons to fucking help him do anything. It was just like, just him and Bond. And he was like, hey, I'm going to go out and do shit. And um, he's like, oh, we're going to go kill this guy. Hey, can I take the shot instead of you? I think <laughs> like, he was like, yeah. And, like, hold, putting that rifle on Bond's shoulder. That was cool. Or even, <laughs> even when he did it, like, offered his at first. Yeah, when they use each other as a stabilizer, it was, was dope. Yeah, he yeah. just... Mm. Um, I think we should bring up, too, importantly, that this is the f- first on-screen appearance of Ernst Stravo Blofeld. You never see his face, but the head of Spectre. They, they don't even refer to him by his name. They refer to him as number one. Uh, I guess you saw, too, what happens when you fail, Inspector. Yeah. See, uh, I, I don't know why number three didn't get killed. He gave her a shot at redemption, which she did not. And she's frail, so. Yeah, she was very, that woman had a very scowling, mean face. <laughs> yeah. Um, she didn't look as bad. Uh, okay. I'm not even going to put it like that. She didn't look as crazy whenever she was in the. Uh, the maid outfit at the end? No, not no, not the maid outfit. I like the, whenever she was like uh, wearing the uh, Russian 
Oh, when she was in, like, back like, in the USSR like, and yeah, stuff? Yeah, and yeah stuff. at the, uh, whatever consulate or if that's... She that looked was. scared as hell when she thought she was going to die. Um, I think the last thing I want to wrap up on this one, for me, as far as important Bond knowledge... This is the fifth book in the Ian Fleming series, mm. and he didn't know if he was going to write anymore after. So the way the book ends at the end, where he's having a little fight with the uh, her and her little poison shoe, <laughs> he actually gets scratched, and he's like, "Oh fuck!" And she's like, "James, James," and he's like talking about like narratively like dying happy, but oh, shit. which he didn't because he wrote more books. But uh, I think uh, that's we're right about with the end of this one. But before we wrap it up, we'll talk about the one thing that I know Whitehead did not like. It was the only negative thing I heard him say. You did not like that shit at the end with the hand on the boat in the tank. <laughs> it, it just looked it looked weird. They had the they had the fake background, but like I don't I know like why I don't know why they did though. That and that was another part of it that confused me because like, they really were on that boat. I don't know if that was a because there was an I think there was another part where they're on the boat whenever he's like taking pictures. I'm using air quotes when I say that. If you can't tell by the inflection of my voice, um, and it's really a recording device. I want to say they do it did it at that point too. It went. Like, Maybe for, like, one boy. shot they did. And I just was like, why? I don't know if it's, like, a secondary thing where they're like, oh, shit, we need to do quick reshoots. That's what I think the hand might have been. The hand thing was just... That shit was cheesy. It was just weird. Yeah, and, uh, I agree. I guess he just wanted to... I guess I just wanted to let you know, like, he's getting rid of his sex tape. Yeah. Bond's not trying to pair silk. Yeah, I, he did say yeah. bye-bye. I'd have said, fuck that. I'd have kept that I shit. I might have kept like, that shit, like, hey, like, the next, the next Bond girl be like, hey, you want to you wanna watch, you, you watch a movie? You, yeah, yeah. For you want to watch a movie? You want to watch one of my performances? Take some notes. Take some notes, you oh. stupid guinea bitch. <laughs> and that, that, that's uh, one uh, last uh, thing uh, I want to uh, mention, uh, too. Uh, when Bond sends that tape back to uh, headquarters, yeah, and he's like, describe the device to me in the camera, and she's what? all like, I love you, James. I love you. Yes, sir? What, yeah, what'd you no, say? No, I'm listening. I'm just oh, listening. I thought you were saying something. Yeah, I thought you said something. No. Oh. So I, I just heard something, too, and I was like, what? Mm-hmm. 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 But, mm. uh. I really like From Russia with Love, and if you haven't seen it, I, I say check it out. But yeah, it's a good check one. it out. We got anything before we get out of here, gentlemen? On whatever the hell we're calling these, we still haven't. I'm gonna give this uh, four point five out of five. Good enough, Ian. I hope uh, you will watch the next one with us, man. But you oh, haven't yeah. watched them separately, which is awesome. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hopefully, I can watch it with you guys. But yeah, if not, I uh, they have them. Uh, they have them on a the thing. I've been watching them on and stuff too. I don't cool, cool. Yeah, hell yeah. All right, we'll catch you guys in the next one of these. Bye. Bye. Bye.